Hello, I'm MSCB and welcome to Makeup Mileage and Pose. This series is all about getting more from your makeup and yourself. Today I'm going to be playing around with eyeshadows. I've got this number 7 eyeshadow palette and I'm going to show you free looks that you can create from it. For this first look, I'm going to apply eyeshadow shades from this palette in a very natural way, perfect for everyday wear. First take the light pink shade on a flat eyeshadow brush and wash the colour over the eyelid. This gives a really nice shade to the eyes and provides a base to build up the rest of the look. Keeping this makeup very natural, take the dark brown shade and lightly line the eye along the upper and lower lash line and build up the colour in the outer corners. This just gives a bit of definition to the eye. Then blend well with a diffusing eyeshadow brush. So there's the finished look, which is a super quick fail safe for day to day makeup. This next eyeshadow look is the classic smoky eye, created from just two different shades. Using a flat eyeshadow brush, patch the light pink shade over the eyelid and up to the socket line. Then sparingly, take the dark grey shade on a large eyeshadow brush and start building up colour in the socket line and in the outer corner. Keep blending in small circular motions to really soften the colour transition and keep adding the darker shade until you're happy with it. Then to define the eye, line the upper and lower lash line with a pencil. And blend with a mixture of the two eyeshadow shades. So there we go, an easy way to perfect the smoky eye. The last look shows how you can replace an eyeliner with an eyeshadow to create a cool, smudgy cat eye look. Using a precise eyeshadow brush and a dark purple shade, draw the cat eye outline over the eyelid and past the outer corner. Then fill in the shape with the eyeshadow using a small flat brush. Soften the edges by blending in circular motions with a fluffy brush. There's the finished look. It was seen on the Chanel catwalk, so it's a must try on a night out. So there are three ideas for you to get more mileage out of your existing makeup. Do let us know if you try the looks at home and catch us next week where we'll be focusing on foundation. Bye!